When an alarm is real, every second counts. And central station operators need the full picture in order to make informed dispatch decisions. Video alarm verification provides them with real-time situational insight into the protected premises for alarm confirmation. AlarmNet is integrating with iView Now, a patented cloud-based central station interface that makes video alarm verification as easy as pushing a button. For the remainder of this video, we will refer to video alarm verification as VAV. With the integration of AlarmNet and iView Now services, dealers and central stations will need to program VAV accounts in both portals. The video helps to demonstrate at a high level both portals and the simple steps to take to enable a Honeywell Total Connect VAV account. If you have any questions, you are encouraged to call Honeywell Technical Support at 800-222-6525. Select Menu Option 1, then Menu Option 5. For iView Now Support, call 888-252-1644 and select Menu Option 2. For this example, we will enable VAV for an existing account that is associated with the Lynx system and during the account review any associated capabilities offered with Lynx products, for example, two-way voice will be seen. Depending on whether you are a central station or a dealer programming the account, you may see different menu headers in AlarmNet Direct. In this example, we are logging in as a central station user. Open a web browser and go to the AlarmNet Direct web portal. https colon slash slash services dot alarmnet dot com slash alarmnet direct. Log in using your AlarmNet Direct credentials. Enter your username and password, then click the arrow. Select Show Program Devices from the Program Devices menu. Enter your device MAC ID. Click Search. Select Edit from the Actions pull-down menu, then click Go. You should now see the Account Summary screen. Look for the VAV Enabled tab and click the Edit icon to enable VAV. The Enabled Video Alarm Verification screen will be displayed. It currently reads No. Change it to Yes and click Next through the remaining pages. You will now see the account summary with VAV enabled. Click Finish. You will see a final page instructing you to complete the VAV configuration in the iView Now portal. The central station representative will log into the portal using his or her iView Now credentials. Enter your username and password. Click Login. Click on Create a Site to create your customer's account. You will now be required to put in the end user's information for the account you are creating. As a central station, you will also see additional selections on this page, such as billing, guard tours, and other options to choose from. In this example, we will only be showing this section to set up the end user's information. At the bottom of the screen, click on the disclaimer and then click Create Site to complete the site creation. 
click on the device model to choose from the drop-down menu. In this example, we will choose Honeywell and then Total Connect 2 plus AlarmNet from the pull-down menus. Click the Add Devices to Account button. You will now see your site details. Click on Expand to configure your devices. Click Edit this device to set time zone and account information. Enter your AlarmNet account information so it may be associated with this VAV site. Click Update Device. Your device will now be updated. Now that the installing dealer has created an account in AlarmNet Direct, and the central station has created and configured the account site in the iView Now portal, the installing dealer may now configure the Honeywell Total Connect IP cameras in the Honeywell Total Connect site. Log into the end user's Honeywell Total Connect account in order to configure the cameras within the Honeywell Total Connect platform. Once you have logged in, open the Video Module section. Click on the wrench icon in the camera thumbnail to edit and configure your camera settings. Select the Name and Date Time icon. Name the camera. In this example, we will choose Front Door. Enable the icons for Adjust for Daylight Savings and Timestamp Visible. Select the Capture Notification settings to configure the camera notification's capture lengths. For this example, we will choose Video Clip. We recommend a pre-capture length be at 8 seconds for video alarm verification, a post-capture length of 2 seconds, and an interval of 1 minute. It is highly recommended that the capture length be tested at the site for accuracy. For VAV, do not enable the icons for PIR or motion. We recommend not including a schedule for video alarm verification so the Honeywell Total Connect cameras configured may take a video clip at any time. Click on the Event Detection Areas icon. Event Detection Areas should not be configured for Total Connect VAV. Total Connect VAV video clips will be based upon a sensor open event, not motion. Click Other Features and adjust settings as necessary for acceptable video quality. Click the Camera Information icon to show the status of the camera data. Before you exit the Configuration section, it is extremely important to click Save to save all of your settings you just programmed. Since the end user has access to all camera configurations through their Total Connect account, we strongly encourage you to communicate with your customer on the importance of not altering these settings for VAV purposes. Total Connect VAV video clips are based upon a sensor open event, not motion. We want to capture a video clip as soon as the protected zone is opened, so we will set up our video capture triggers for a sensor open condition. Go to the Events and Notifications section. Click on Setup. Click on the Security icon. Click on Sensor Open Close. Click on Sensor Open. Select the desired sensor in the list. In this example, we will select Sensor 3. Then select Plus Video Capture. We don't necessarily want to capture a video clip every time the sensor is opened. Therefore, we will limit the video captures to scenarios where the sensor is opened in an armed state, which will result in an alarm condition if the system is not disarmed. We suggest selecting Armed Away for the schedule state.
For camera, select the VAV camera associated with the sensor in the drop-down. In this example, we will select Camera 8WI. Click Plus Video Capture again. For the schedule state, select Armed Stay. For camera, select the VAV camera associated with the sensor in the drop-down. In this example, we will select Camera 8WI. Click Save. Video events are now set up upon sensor open in the selected scenarios with the corresponding Total Connect VAV camera. If you have any questions on programming in AlarmNet Direct, you are encouraged to call Honeywell Technical Support at 800 222 6525. Select Menu Option 1, then Menu Option 5. If you have any questions on configuring Honeywell Total Connect Remote Services, call 800 222 6525, option 1, and then option 4. If you have any questions on programming in the iView Now portal, you are encouraged to call 888-252-1644 and select menu option 2.